Hello. Let's get set up here. I don't know why I did that. Oh, yeah. Let's see. I believe it should automatically tweet that I'm alive. Honestly, not very sure. actually redirecting <laughs> that's awesome okay what's up guys guess I gotta get into YouTube here real quick I was not very prepped on the technology side for this stream but it looks like everything is working if you're here and you want to say hi in the chat, please do. <laughs> uh, today, we've got another IPS mod. It is, actually, before I get into it, let's pull up some music. Because it feels weird just hearing the hum of my PC fans. There we go. Okay. Hello, Angelo. I remember that name in the profile picture. How are you today? <laughs> oh, I'm not blue anymore. My webcam was doing this weird thing where I was blue for a minute. I don't know why. This is also a little loud. Alright, that sounds a lot better. Yeah, I'm professional and totally prepared for the stream. <laughs> but, we've got a Game Boy Color, I believe from Japan. Yep, from Japan. And uh, it's actually... They, it's got several things wrong with it. The uh, shell is slightly yellowed. There's no uh, back plate here. But, this is... a honestly one of the cooler shells that was uh, authentic but it's also got a bad screen so several things wrong with it I might uh, I might try and do something with this shell because it is pretty cool uh, I think this is a Japan only color I'm not totally sure but we're gonna be doing a black and orange theme here this is coming up red on my screen but this is very much orange so without any further ado let's jump into it I'm glad to see you're doing good today Angela okay just throw that over there for now let's try wing first yeah, that's pretty center. I don't think anyone has opened this before because these screws are pretty stiff. stiff. And I'm back to being blue. I don't know what's going on with the color temperature on my webcam today. Super clean on the inside, too. This is like pristine on the inside. There's like not even 
Dude, it feels brand new. That is a shame that this has a burned screen. You probably can't tell. Oh yeah, you can definitely tell on screen there. It's actually easier to see right here than in person. That's interesting. But, I don't even think I'm going to have to clean this thing. screws are untouched because it was actually a slight bit of a struggle to open that up. <laughs> Just get all the screws off to the side here. And even the membranes, like everything looks insanely good. Wow. I don't think I've seen a Game Boy in this good of condition before. I'm just amazed by the cleanliness of the thing, but I'm not even... I think I'll clean the speaker, but this honestly doesn't need to be cleaned whatsoever. It's weird that something as old as me is so clean, yet so broken. Okay, I will go ahead. I'm just gonna. I don't even think I need the IPA. Nope, I don't need the IPA. That's it. That is all the cleaning we have to do to this thing. Wow. Alright. Cool. So from here, what do I do from here? I guess we will just... Oh, what's the... We will have to trim these posts down here, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Uh, real quick though. Okay. Cool. So I had to check, check something real quick. But we're just going to trim all these little things down here. Yo! Ezra in the building. How are you doing, Ezra? Also, if you guys ever decide to do this, uh, wear eye protection, don't be like me. This is very much a do as I say, not as I do. trimmed up. I just realized this camera's running on battery power. Uh, I usually plug it into the wall. <laughs> it is not... my dummy battery is not in. So, uh, 
Hopefully this doesn't die. It's got a pretty nice battery though. Again, 100% professional. <laughs> Mortal Kombat for the, the DMG was amazing though. I don't know what you're talking about. I love having only like four buttons to use moves with. Okay. Ezra, you missed how I was just gawking at how clean this board is. Like, I did not clean it at all. Like, this is the only real dirt on it. Now it's bugging me enough that I'll actually clean it. But I didn't use any IPA on it. It's just that clean. And it had never been opened before. Now it's the cleanest Game Boy ever. It is, like, straight out of the factory clean, and I do not understand how it can be so clean yet have a bad screen but okay let's see here I'm going to grab one of these and lay it down Let's open up the mod kit. And let's do this before I forget, because I always forget. Wait, what? They gave me two stickers? That doesn't seem right. Okay. But... I always forget to put this on, so let's do that. That's off. Oh man, this is a strong sticker too, isn't it? Oh my gosh, don't do that. So now, we can just peel these side stickers up. Boom. There we go. I really love the laminated screens because uh, that way I don't have to worry about getting fingerprints or dust underneath the screen lens. Okay, I was starting to forget how you put these in for a second, but it's just like that. And now the screen is fully in. It's that simple. Okay. Yeah, I don't know why they gave me another sticker. That must be to a different kit, and I just haven't realized it yet. And the wires are always so annoying to get out on this one. They like to stick to the inside of the bag. There we go. Okay. Should just be able to go click this in, 
Sometimes it's the easiest thing to do, sometimes it's the hardest thing to do. Okay. Now that we've done that, we can go ahead and that's what I forgot. Always gotta forget something. I forgot the uh, the cord for the soldering iron. This is uh, not a Bluetooth soldering iron, sadly. So I will go grab that cord real quick. Don't go anywhere. solder really glad that wasn't on yet <laughs> no thank you dad I'm good I don't need anything from subway that is uh, probably not something that happens very often with streamers they're Families asking if they want any food. <laughs> okay. So, what we're going to do is we're going to solder. I'll zoom in. Twist it a little bit there. Not too much. We're going to solder to P13 and P12 and that's what we need to do for now pretty sure I just blocked that with my finger didn't I Now I've just made that super dirty. Okay. Can you see that? Yeah. Beautiful. Boom. It's that simple, ladies and gentlemen. This is not the time to be calling me. Okay. Mikey should know. I'm on stream. I guess that's a good segue for me to say. Put on uh, the notification bell on my channel so you can get updated whenever I go live which is especially good because uh, this might be the last Monday stream for a while the streams won't be going away but we will most likely be changing the day of the week that we stream
and I don't have a new name for it. Hi, Mikey. Did you just realize why I didn't answer your call? I can't be the IT guy right now. Mikey, it'll just be a different day of the week. It's fine. <laughs> but if you have a good name that rhymes or is an alliteration for a different day of the week, uh, then that would be awesome, because I really liked Mod Monday, but can't really do streams on Monday anymore, because I will be busy on Mondays. It's a Game Boy Color, Mikey, and is I'm still blown away by the fact that it's insanely clean. I really didn't have to clean it at all. Like ninety nine percent of it was is still untouched. Okay, let's see here. Um, what's the next step? Let's just put that over there. Let's get some solder on these two points here. Okay. It's right in front of me. Couldn't find my solder. That is also just that simple. Okay. So, now, it's a really interesting close-up on my hand. Now it's not going to focus on it. Whatever. Okay. So, start is this one. Just grab it with my tweezers here. Boom. There's start. Come on now. Hey, you can't see it. Boom. Now, put the soldering iron down one more time. We'll still need to use it in a second, but I need to put some Kapton tape down. Tricking out Tuesday. That's actually not too bad. I would like to do it on Tuesdays, because I want to keep the Friday post date and I want to keep the uh, the video posting and the streaming on separate sides of the week. I want it to be as spaced out as possible. I was also thinking about just posting on Mondays again and doing some sort of Friday stream. My other, like, I've, I haven't found one that I'm, like, happy with. But I was thinking Fix It Friday, and I'm like, eh. And Refurb Thursdays, eh. And there's always the classic Tech Tuesday, but it's a lot of different YouTubers that do Tech Tuesday. Okay, 
There's that. And then one more little piece of capped on tape over this weird little chip. Because this one always causes a short for me. I have no idea why. But now I'm actually going to reuse the old membranes from this that are a little bit dusty. Can I zoom out a little bit there? There we go. But just the tiniest bit dusty, so we're going to lightly clean them. There's that one. And then the buttons are right here. So we'll just drop those in. Whoa. And then the power switch. Whoa. Yeah, this is this is a little dirty, but I don't know if you're gonna be able to see that. And it's too blown out. <laughs> and you can kinda see the dirt there. It's just a lit a little dirty. Nothing a quick Brushing can't fix. I do love how fast IPA dries. It's very, very nice. Seven viewers in here. Hello, everyone. We're a quiet bunch in the chat today, but that's all right. Okay, and those are the buttons done. So, now we can just flip this over. I don't think it's going to interfere with anything. Yeah, okay, cool. Just got to make sure that the buttons aren't interfered with. And... Drop that in. There we go. Now, I'm going to try and find. Where did my screwdriver go? The Phillips heads, drive those in real quick. There's that one. There's screw number two. And then there should be one more. Should be this one. They're slightly shorter than the tri wings, so it's a little easier to pick out in the crowd. Looks like a Lego. That's the problem with the delay and also me not looking at the chat twenty four seven is I don't know what you're referring to. I'm assuming the power switch that looks most Lego like to me. But yeah, this is looking nice. Oh, you can't see it. <laughs> I like this a lot. And 
go ahead and push that ribbon cable in as far as possible lock it in and then we've got two more I said two more two more wires to solder we are done with the scissors and the kept on tape but last bit of soldering here and 300 degrees Celsius so we can go ahead there's one am I there we go thought I wasn't gonna have to add more solder which I probably didn't but it's quite a bit of solder on my tip sort of see it. It's not the most exciting. There's that. And I swear I just heard someone behind me for some reason. Come on now. Why is this not wanting to solder right? <laughs> Beautiful. Oh wait, no. <laughs> One more thing to solder. Gotta solder this wire somewhere, huh? Okay, we'll zoom in for this one. Because it's kind of a tricky one. So, we got a solder to C on the power switch. But you can't actually see it. See it. <laughs> okay. Question is... How do I line this up? That looks good. The joint looks good. I'm going to call it good. I have no idea how much of that you saw. But we'll try and tuck this down here so it doesn't get in the way of the screw hole is that would screw things up I did forget one last thing <laughs> one last thing I need some double sided tape for this I'll be right back Okay, this is the tail end of the stream here, and all we're going to do is cut up a piece of this extra double-sided tape that I've got, been cutting away at it for a while. There we go. And now I'm actually done with the scissors. Just gotta peel it back. And we'll put it on the IR sensor there, because 
you don't really need the IR sensor. I don't think it has any function at all once you, uh, once you mod it. Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure all it was for was for automatically adjusting the contrast based off of, like, the light or whatever. The surrounding light. Okay. Just make sure that's how it goes in. Because I always forget. That looks pretty locked into me. And now, all we got to do is put down the rest of the shell. And I'm just gonna be wild and not test it until it's fully put together. But again, do as I say, not as I do. Always test the screen before you even start your soldering. Unless you have to solder or something to get it to turn on. Like this case. Or this screen. I think they gave me extra screws. Unless I can't count. No, they gave me an extra screw. Gave me an extra screw. Gave me extra stickers. And we will go ahead and slide in the coolest game cart of all time. And boom. Let's slide the battery cover on. Boom. Look at that. We can zoom out a little bit now. That's zooming in. Boom. She's beautiful. And the peel didn't really make a noise. It was hardly even on there, to be honest. Now, this even... I need to look at it away from the screen. It looks red. That's over here. All the buttons are working. I still don't know why. The touchpad is not. Huh. have to go back inside do some digging thankfully we don't have to go too far it's been a very fast stream even though I forgot a few things there really haven't been any hiccups We should be done. <laughs> We'd be done very soon if I uh, didn't have this hiccup. But this is definitely a problem that I can solve. I just skipped over the the middle two screws here.
Yeah, I mean, the touch sensor is definitely soldered in. Go ahead, stick it out. That's orange, okay. The other one definitely was red then. Right. Now this time we hold both of them down. Beautiful, it is locked in. Now I just gotta figure out why the sensor isn't going when it's in the shell. Which probably just needs to be replaced. Wasn't the best placement either, but we're gonna put it back in here again without screws. Interesting. Maybe I'll put it somewhere. I'm, I'm determined to make this work now. Okay, last last try. Because I know it works. I just and I've done it. I literally every time I do this mod, it's on the IR sensor. There we go. Sort of. It did it once. Hmm. I guess we'll do it on the hard plastic. Lame. At least with this one, it's nice to you can see through it so you'll know where it is instantly but that's why i like to do it on the ir blaster so you automatically are like oh this spot looks and feels different from the rest of the show so i'll have to cut this one more time Putting it 
right there. Should be perfect. Once again, we will close this up. No screws. Easy peasy. Okay. Any specific tips for fingernail care when working with electronics? Uh, if you're talking about keeping them clean, good luck. Five, six, seven. There we go. Seven levels of brightness on this one. I don't know why. Uh, keeping them clean is, uh, yeah, just good luck. But... <laughs> The, uh, I, I don't know how I don't, like, chip or crack my nails more often when I work with stuff. Kind of a miracle, but I always try and keep them long enough that I can get them underneath things, because I have to get underneath these small electronics all the time. But other than that, uh, having a mom that's a beautician is pretty, pretty key for my nail care. It's also why I have such good hair that I keep under a hat all the time. <laughs> that, that sounds bad. I, I do love my hair, I just hate having to do it. So that's why I wear a hat a lot. But when I'm off camera, or just sitting at home, which is a lot of the time, uh, I don't wear a hat. And it's not because... I'm surprising. I'm surprised that I haven't got more comments that are like, oh, he's balding or something like that. That's not why I wear a hat. I have a full, very full head of hair. I'm just lazy. But now we can finally put this thing fully together, turn it on. Boom. Everything works. It's too bright. There we go. You can see it. Good enough. I'm always going to go for this, but it's over the middle somewhere. Are you serious? Okay, well, I'm just going to fix this stupid touch sensor off screen. Oh, this is annoying. I wonder why it's doing that. Can I, like, poke it? Will that do anything? I don't know why. Don't pull out your game cards when they're on. That's a bad idea. <laughs> but I don't know. This has been a good stream. <laughs> Most people want it on full brightness anyways. So if you guys did enjoy, please leave a like. Scott, oh, thank you. I just noticed the... I'm not even going to try and pronounce your name because I don't want to butcher it. Uh, but thank you. I appreciate the kind words. Uh, <laughs> Scott and everybody else who missed it, this is most likely the last Mod Monday stream for a while. Uh, I will be busy on Mondays now, so I cannot stream. So if you have any other ideas for other days to stream and... Uh, because I'm not going to be Mod Tuesday. I guess I could do that for a temporary title, you know. But 
uh, if you can find an alliteration that is a synonym for mod and then another day of the week, uh, that would be awesome. I'm trying to figure that out right now. But that's all I've got for this today. If you want to buy this mod you see here with a working touch sensor, you know how to try it again. Okay. <laughs> with a working touch sensor, I can guarantee that. This will be on sale on my website probably later tonight, uh, if not definitely tomorrow. I am very busy the rest of the day, plus uh, my boys are playing tonight. So that comes first, obviously. But I will try and put a link in the description. Uh, there is already a link to my website in the description, retroremaster.com. I am talking way more now than I did uh, most of the stream. But uh, we modded a GBA SP last week, and the week before last we did a GBA. We mix it up all the time. I try not to do the same mods uh, two weeks in a row. But wet when wet Wednesdays, Scott. Let's keep it PG here, my my boy. But we don't want to get these wet. That's bad. Ah, uh, but Wednesday wouldn't be a bad day to stream. I, I'm really open to all days of the week that are not Monday, Sunday, or Saturday. <laughs> so, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Uh, if we end up streaming closer to Friday, then I will probably swap the upload date to Mondays again. I don't know. That'll be something I try and figure out this week. I am going to uh, stop streaming now because I got nothing else to say. Good night. It is morning for me, but good night to you. Good morning to... Or it's not morning. It's, it's 1 o'clock, almost. It's my morning. I've only been up for three hours, so... <laughs> Noon to 1, even like 2 o'clock is still technically morning to me, so... Anyways, I'm going to shut up now. Thank you guys for coming out. I will see you on Friday for a very special upload featuring another creator, hopefully. I gotta get in contact with them. <laughs>